Who uses full set bonuses? I mean, why would you when you could get 100 crit damage, 45 ability damage, or even double healing? But most importantly, 400% more damage. Being the best helmet in the game, the Warden Helmet is crazy for damage. After killing countless zombies, I gave up trying to drop it myself. But now that the price is almost halved, I decided to do it. I bought the Warden Helmet, and here's how. First, let me explain why I'm doing this. After dropping the Hyperion, I wanted the only weapon better than it in the game, the Terminator. However, I need to kill hundreds of Endermen with over 400 million health to get Enderman Slayer 7, so I need damage. I have a mod that makes the Enderman beacons red, just like the subscribe button. The next mayor is Aatrox, who buffs all Slayers by 25% and makes them cheaper, so this is the perfect time to do it. Well, it's time to claim this, the Warden Helmet. Let's go! Now that I have the Warden Helmet, it is time to go kill some Endermen. First, we need a few items. So now I need to change my Hyperion to a Scylla and get the Vorpal Katana. The Vorpal Katana recently got a huge buff, making it way better than the Giant Sword or the Emerald Blade. Let's get this one with one for all. The best thing about the Warden Helmet is the Black Cat is actually a damage pet with it. This makes it really good for Slayers. Unfortunately, for Endermen, health is needed, so I will have to use a different pet. There are three options for this. The Ender Dragon, the Baby Yeti, and the Turtle Pet. The Ender Dragon is way too expensive, so that leaves these two. I already have a Baby Yeti, but I think a Turtle might be better, so let's test it. Okay, after my guild member let me test his, I think the Baby Yeti will be best for now. Now. If I had a level 100 turtle it might be better, but I can't afford that. So with my gear all ready, it is time to do some Ender Slayer. I quickly want to see the damage difference with Warden. So with the Tarantula Helmet, it looks like I do a little over 700k. And with the Warden Helmet, I do over 800k. So after trying a tier 3 boss, I decided it was time for the tier 4. I was not confident at all though. I am a few kills away. Let's do this. It was doing an insane amount of damage to me. I had to use my healing items constantly. And eventually, this happened. There are still a few things I can do to have a better chance against this boss. I can get some final destination pieces for more defense. But that didn't do any good, so the only thing left is to get the Adam Split Katana, and maybe not use one for all. I mean, I did get a little farther in the boss. I could also try a full set of Final Destination, but then my damage wouldn't be very good. I have a lot of grinding ahead of me, so I'm going to do that in the next video. Bye!